Hello everybody, I am Lisbeth and you guys are watching the real episode 24 of my Oxygen Not Included Let's Play series. Uh, today, um, I've done a little bit in between. Um, I finished all of this up. We can now deconstruct these two. They're mopping everything up over here. Um, I've sorted out gas filtering because there was a tiny bit of polluted oxygen, but once this is all gone, that'll be fine. And I've also put an atom sensor here so that when this goes dormant, um, I'm not pumping needlessly and wasting power and stuff like that. Uh, what else have I done? I caught all the mobs over here. They are now all in here. Uh, I think that's all five. There should be... S oh, there's six. One is that shine bug up there, so that's very good. Uh, we can deconstruct this for now and put our uh, water sieve back in because we don't want these to run out of power. Uh, run out of water, sorry. Uh, now, what else? Um, just one moment. Refinery, water sieve. So, today we're getting these farms up and running. Now, as you can see, I've queued up a fair bit of... Uh, we're not going to make those out of steel. We don't need to make them out of steel because it's going to be very cold in there. So we can go auto sweeper. We can actually make these ones out of lead. Like that. Um, these ones will be a bit hotter. We don't want to make these out of steel either. But we can make them out of gold. For example. Two. Three. We'll put them there, I think. Um, those don't need to be steel. I thought I had this all ready just to go, and they're not. Uh, that is not going to be too hot for... Yes, like that. Um, now these guys will need... One moment, arbor acorns. We'll need dirt as well, so we're gonna need some of these. Yeah, making them out of copper is just fine. Um, and we'll have to put some more rails in, but first... Do I not... Oh, that's like copper copper. Yeah, that's fair enough. Um, we can make these out of lead as well, because it's uh, gonna be not too hot in there. These ones are steel because it's going to be a bit warm in here, but that's fine. So, let's walk through this step by step. Um, and we'll start up here, I suppose. So this is our ethanol distillery. Uh, scaled up. Now if we go to... Nope, shipping. There we go. Um, wood from the lumber farm will come in here. So we get wood coming in, goes into the ethanol distillery... Uh, now, ethanol distilleries produce polluted dirt, which come out through the conveyor loader. Simple enough. Um, so our auto sweepers should be able to reach all of them. If they can't, I can put another one, you know, I can put two more in here. Um, I'd rather not, but if I have to, I will. Uh, that's fine, that's whatever. We can do whatever the hell we want with that. Uh, now back a step here to our lumber farm which will make lumber for the ethanol distillery um oh wait before we go from the ethanol distillery we get ethanol coming out that needs to go in the opposite direction um but we will get ethanol coming out and going into our nosh sprout farm because the nosh beans need ethanol beautiful very good Excellent. Um, I need to turn that around. This is our cooling loop, I believe. Uh, that's our warming loop, sorry. That's fine. Uh, now, over here in the lumber area, um, arbor acorns need dirt, so we've got that coming in through the conveyor receptacle. I'll build that in just a second, and the lumber will go out into the ethanol distillery. Very good. All right, shipping. Uh, now we're gonna need, obviously, some conveyor bridges. We can go that way and that way, yes. And then we need the rails to go down here 
because they will need dirt to grow. Uh, now, this is producing dirt through this rail line here, like so. One moment. Cancel these ones. And we will need a conveyor bridge going up that way and out into there. So the that's how pollute uh, that's how dirt dirt coming in here into the lumber. Now here we have shipping. Um, polluted dirt comes in here to be composted and comes out this way to go either to the nosh beans or to uh, sorry yeah to the nosh beans or to the trees over here. Um, now I did calculate that this would produce enough, I'm fairly sure, like I'm, I'm fairly confident that we're going to be producing enough dirt. Yes. Right. Compost. I need 20 compost heaps, which is 1.86 compost heaps per tree. Yeah, I should, I'm fairly certain, be producing. Uh, if not, I will have to uh, find a way to produce a lot of polluted dirt. Um, but for now, that's okay. We can sort that out in the future. Um, was there anything else? We talked about the Nosh farm. Yes, now the last thing I need is to do the pinch of pepper nuts which need phosphorite. Now we do have, I believe, phosphorite. Yeah, look, we've got 13 tons. Uh, now phosphorite, if we just have a quick element, solids, scroll down to P, phosphorite. I could actually, oh well, there anyway. Um, well, that's not helpful. What about... I'm pretty sure Dracos produce phosphorite. Yes. So I can funnel all of my phosphorite from the Dracos into here. Um, which will be these two conveyor receptacles. Um, and that's all they need. Yeah, and they need the polluted water, obviously, but that's fine. Um, and then that will be coming out shipping uh now we get this one to come into here this one will be the nosh beams so this is gonna have to come down go this way this way this way and we're in very good and that's to produce everything for this that can reach yet the whole room lovely um, I think that's everything. Obviously I'll have to, and I don't think I can do it. No, I can't. Um, so I need to actually do research for this. Um, I can have a solid filter, which would be nice, but not really what I need. What I would like is an element sensor, so I can just drop stuff off when it gets to the right place, um, which is, you know, free. Um, just thinking, that can't reach in there. What can that reach? That can't reach that. Um, so I think a solid filter would be the way to go here. Um, for now though, they're just going to have to, we're going to have a conveyor loader. Ooh, about here, I say. Could put it, no I couldn't, I was going to say I could put it in here, but that had flooded I think. Um, so we're going to put this here. Whoops, uh, we will need power on that actually, let's, let's think about that in a second. Uh, I'm going to let them build this, I'm going to of course put power in. Um, and keep in mind, this is going to use a bit of power, so we're going to start to want, start to, want to um, 
think about our power situation again. Um, now, I know I made that petroleum boiler and I have not used it. Um, I need to modify that just a smidge, but it'll be fine. Um, I'll get that all sorted out off camera. Basically what I'm going to do is run the oil backwards through it uh, to cool it down just a little bit. Alright, that should be powerful, that section, which is good. And I think because it's all going to be used so sporadically, the only thing that's continuously running is these six. And I need a calculator. 240 times 6 is 1440. So that is cutting it kind of close to the 2 kilowatt. Um, I do have this line. No, I don't like that idea. Um, we're going to cut this off here. We're going to put this lot on this line. Like this. Sounds good to me. Um, how am I going to do this? I might go that way. And we're going to snip that, that, that. These ones can be dismantled. Yes, like that. Okay. And then we run that across that way. Uh, and we will put these, this bit on another circuit. So we're going to have another couple of power transformers, like, oh, say, there and there. No way. Like that. We'll have to deconstruct these. And put tiles there. And we can't do that. We cannot put a heavy watt wire plate there either. Uh, let's put it up higher. So it'll have to go there and there. Uh, we are no matter what going to have to uproot this arbitrary. I was hoping to not do that. You know what? I could just move it over. Um, can't go there. So that'll have to go like this. Whoops. Man, I just can't place things today. How about... No. Oh! Take five. Turn it around. There we go. And we're going into this line. And we need a... Conductive wire bridge like that. All right, that'll be that circuit separate. This one separate. This needs a bit, tiny bit of a rework, I think. Yeah. Um. Yeah, I might have to like split it here or something. Um, I could run that on a single transformer because a lot of the stuff doesn't get used very often. Like the shearers are only 60 watts. Um, and these, like they all get used so rarely. I could put this on a one kilowatt circuit. I think I will. Uh, that can go right there. And we're going to go up this way, like that, and then this can get cut off right there and deconstruct those, and that should split those two circuits up. Alright, that's good. Um, Alright, and last thing, choose a printable, and then I'm going to let them build it all. I don't think I want... The 11 strength is pretty good, even the 8 strength. Um, yeah. Welcome, Harry. Yep, and that is for Ari. Beautiful. Uh, now, skills. Improved carrying, of course. You can have yourself a cool little hat. 
Um, but you will be supplying. I would like you building as well, please. All right. Sounds good. Sounds very good. Now that is unreachable, really. We can solve that problem. Uh, and I would like to catch a few more mobs just for fun. There's one in here. Um, there's quite a few over here, but honestly that can happen any time. Um, I might just want to like groove a bit and play some games and um, I don't have enough copper. That's okay. That's all copper, copper, copper. Now I would like to, is that just because they can't access it? That's my table salt, that's okay. So it's just because we don't have enough oxygen coming through. Um, which is a failure on what capacity? These are max gas pressure. Hmm. All right. Well, <coughs> sorry. I'm going to get this sealed up as well, of course, uh, and then I'll be right back once we're all built up and ready to go.
uh, what have we gotten done in between takes? Uh, so, we've gone and gotten everything built here, of course. Um, I vacuumed out this bit here, and we're going to fill it now with carbon dioxide. That's what this water lock here is for. Uh, because these need carbon dioxide to grow in, right? The atmosphere has to be carbon dioxide. So I've got to keep an eye on this, because uh, I don't want to put like heaps and heaps and heaps in here. Um, yeah, I would like to, you know, not have like 20 kilos in here, just like a couple each tile, like room atmosphere, I guess. Uh, let's see. But it'll take a while. I mean, I suppose you can't breathe any of it, so... What does that matter? I'm sweet everything up. Except for that road one. Um... This is going fine, we've got branches growing. Um, we're gonna put a bunch of pips in here. I've gotten all the bedrooms looking a bit prettier. Ah, finally. Um, now, next I am going to have to go to space and research, do the orbital micro lab stuff, um, because I really need solid sorting for the next bit, because I need to get uh, all of the phosphorite coming out of these drecos, because they produce... Ah, it's too hot, that's a bummer. Um, they produce phosphorite, 9 kilograms a cycle, which I think between these two farms is enough for these. Like, they need 1 kilo a cycle, so like, eight, 1... Okay, we're fine. Um, one Dreco will cover all of these. So, if my math in my head's correct. Um, I don't think there's much else. Um, yeah, I'm gonna have to next episode go to space um, with Ellie. Uh, let's keep an eye on this. Let's just snip this and call it there. We're gonna deconstruct those. And then we want to deconstruct that one. Okay. Um, and we can just pump it all out there. Um, because possibly that's enough. It's too hot, obviously, that's fine. And we just need ethanol, so that's okay. And it needs a minimum of 25 grams per tile. Yeah, we're fine. Uh, let's check out the power. Just do a tiny little bit of cleanup here and there. Uh, wrong button. There we go. Um, I think that'll be okay for now. Uh, dropped a bit of igneous rock in there, I'm disappointed. But now that we've got cooler water coming through here, this has dropped down to 31 degrees at the top here. Um, 39 coming out, but that's alright. I think it'll drop down a little bit more, even down to 30 would be nice. Aha, a printable. Um, I don't really need any of them, uh, all except for Pips and Pip Squeaks, uh, because we want to start moving these Pips up in here. Um, now this will require a bit of duplicate labour, so to turn the compost heaps over and to Um, I'm going to have to do this on all of them. Uh, and to harvest the arbor trees. Um, so let's go... These is most 
important. Um, so that this guy will actually feed them and then load excess. Because there's going to be pips in here, they'll eat a couple of the other branches and give us some bonus dirt. Because uh, we still need extra dirt for these things. Alright, um, I've also pumped out all the rest of, uh, or at least as much of it as I could, of the chlorine and natural gas that was down here. So things are pretty neat and tidy now in the base. Um, obviously I'd like to clean this up, but it's not the worst. Um, like, it's not really affecting things noticeably. Um... And we've gotten this going, because obviously we need a bit of power. Um, so yeah, this is this is going now. Uh, what else do I need to do next? So obviously researching will be a little bit, but that's really only Ellie and maybe one other person, so we'll have time to do some other projects. Um, ooh. Well, we could use a source of like, hmm. we could have a look at, not that one, uh, there's a copper volcano here. We could do that one, and there's also the Cobalt Volcano right here, right there, uh, and the Aluminium one. I mean, it's nothing really super new, uh, but we can do that. We will also need a bit of extra water, um, so perhaps I can do that. Um, there was another aluminium volcano, wasn't there? It's that. Yeah. Yeah. That sucks. Yeah, this is a bit of a mess over here. Um. It's working. S yeah, okay. Okay, that's fine. Um. Unfortunately, yeah, some nuclear waste got in there. It's a long story. Um, but that's fine. Now... Plumbing. Ah, we're just backed up on water. That's perfectly fine by me. Um, this is also about to go. Um, I'm hoping I'll actually be able to see it happen, because I want to make sure that this works. Yeah, it's a little while away still. Uh, now, as far as cooling in here goes, um, we could use one of these and use the gas as a coolant, but uh, that's like, meh. Might as well just use a, you know, normal cooling loop. Um, could build the third one of these finally. Um, right here. Um, our, the issue is I'm not running this at the moment because I'm short on power and I've got enough materials built up to be able to get away with it, but it also means that we're not cooling because they take, you know, 2.4 kilowatts um, whenever they're running. Um, how are we going with pips? Not bad. Uh, is that too hot? Too cold? Okay. Nothing I can really do about that. This should be on. No? That still hasn't sucked that much heat out of it. Wow. That's impressive. Let's run through a, a few Drekos. Uh, cause we're... struggling just a bit. Um... Alright, but I think for now, I'm gonna have to call it there. I'm, I've got this going... like, most of the way there. Uh, it's just a case of I've got to sit around and wait for this to produce enough. Hmm.
below 100 then. This ought to... Yep, uh, now the one last thing I want to do before we come here, I want to uh, filter out any nuclear waste that comes through. I can literally just drop it here, so we can go... Um, the good pipe element sensor. Uh, yikes. Um, we'll have to deconstruct these, I think. Which is perfectly fine. Uh, let's get that done. So I can do this before we go. I need to filter out nuclear waste because I don't want that to end up in our petroleum boilers. Uh, or petroleum generators. And I had to ex extend this wall here because this is producing steam. Uh, but that's all good. What is this steam? Okay, that's alright. I think. Yeah, no, the steam's from out here. Um, aha, they've done that. So we can get an automation wire. Like that. A vent there. And a element sensor there. This one first, please. That's going better. There we go. There we go. Uh, I should also actually do that and move this up one. What I need to do, now that this should be cooler I think, I ought to be able to put like this. So this doesn't have to fill up here before it stops, you know? Like that. That should be okay. Actually, we will do that one. Cancel that and put that up priority. Alright, there we go. So yeah, I think I'm gonna have to stop there for now. Um, we do not want to make those out of ceramic. Um, just granite's fine. Yeah, hopefully you've enjoyed it. Um, I need to edit this and go to bed. <laughs> um, but yeah, so tomorrow we're going to do that orbital microlab stuff so that I have item filtering. And we're going to filter out nuclear waste. Um... So yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one. Thanks for watching. Bye!